Hey friends, how are you? A little car therapy, out here for a walk. <clears throat> it's a nice bench, I don't usually stop here. Why not? Um, give it a chance, do something different. So let's talk about value, let's talk about worth. And um, what is something worth? You know, uh, there's a business idea that things are worth what people will pay for it. But, but there is a truth to it, and I want to show you how it works emotionally. But things are worth what you pay for it. So for example, I happen to be around a lot of people that uh, are often uh, looking for things for free you know please help me please do a kindness and they'd love to I'd love to help out but when I do a kindness for you let's say you know um, I'll help you build that thing or I'll help you move that thing so I've just given of my time but how much is my time worth well in a certain sense my time is worth nothing because I didn't pay anything for it um, and uh, so people wonder often um, you know the, the prices of you know counseling, coaching, therapy sessions, and stuff, and it has a value. It's also it's not just the value of the time. It's it's the value of talking about yourself, about your life. What is it worth? What is your life worth? You know, um, and we see clearly psychologically when uh, somebody gets something for free, uh, they don't invest in it. Um, they don't take it as seriously because it's not worth it's not worth anything. You gave it to me for you gave me a course. You gave me a course for free. Okay. You know, if I do it, I don't do it. It doesn't really matter. But if I pay for it, I've got some skin in the game, as they say. It's got value. I, I invested in it. I want to get my value out of it. And that's that's why services are paid for. Um, you know, they have a value to it. But um, to go on a deeper level, I mean, I'm not just talking about you know the time that I have. I wish I had all the time in the world to just work with people. Um, you know, <coughs> you know, to help people grow and you know, do and achieve, and uh, I've got my bills, of course, to cover, but there's a value to it, there's a value. How much is it worth to achieve the transformation that you're looking to achieve? How much is it worth to, to feel more confident, more clear, more secure as you talk to people, engage with people? How much is it worth to, um, to better identify uh, bad types of people, toxic types, and to begin to start attracting and identifying uh, better types of people? How much is that worth to you? So there's different ways we value things. Uh, but I want to say there's another aspect of this, this idea of value, which is that you know if I give time or value or something for free, but it's um, I don't just throw it away. I'm not running after people. Someone you know uh, contacts you and uh, you say, yeah, sure, I can help you, but you know Monday's not good for me. Tuesday's going to be better for me. I've now, in a certain sense, made that person pay for it. I didn't just come running whenever you needed it. Um, it's it's not I'm I'm not at your disposal all the time. My time also has value. And this is an aspect of self-respect. As I self-respect my, as I respect myself, self-respect, I begin to to teach other people around me that that's how I want to be treated. And one of the ways that we do that is the the value that our time has, be it money, the cost of, of our services, or the cost of our time, or um, you know, um, will what what it takes to get me to to join in with you or help out help you out. Is it something that I'll throw myself at you, or is it that? <coughs> You know, I'm also going to be mindful of myself. I can help you when it's good for me and convenient for me. Uh, have I ignored my needs and wants, or are they also part of the equation? Uh, let me know what you think.